Hi guys, welcome back to the channel. Today I'm going to be unboxing the Sony PlayStation 5 Access Controller, so we'll get straight into it. We'll show you the packaging, guys, then we'll pull everything out and get a closer look. Do let us know down in the comments what you think, guys, and if you haven't already, do subscribe to the channel. So nicely detailed uh, packaging all the way around, guys. On the front, you can see the uh, Access Controller, which is quite nice. And then on the sides, you've got information, and then on the back goes into a little bit more detail about the actual controller. Shows you uh, more of the uh, different components and parts that are all uh, interchangeable and uh, programmable. So let's, um, looks like we just uh, peel the, uh, the uh, tag there on the front and then it opens up and then we pull another tab and it opens up and you can see that all the contents on the inside of the uh, the box now that we've pulled those tabs up now we've got some uh, information there got all the uh, components there the main unit everything's housed in these um, little trays to um, stop them from being damaged another booklet and we'll just take the uh, whole tray out for this particular one because there's uh, quite a few components there and then we'll just push that to the side guys okay so take a look at our uh, our booklet so it's pretty much a uh, just a quick start guide okay um, all the components are numbered there and then on this side quick start guide sort of how to get started with your controller and then we have our little um, access controller booklet for uh, warranties and stuff like that and we'll take a look at our controller now okay so we've got our access controller here guys so quite nice front and rear there okay you've got your um, all your buttons as well across the top there we're going to take a look at all the uh, components that you can uh, add to these all right um, you've got your uh, playstation button there and as soon as you push that it does light up so it does want to um, either sync or connect to your uh, system there uh, you've got usb on the back there as well as e1 to 4 um, and then you've got your um, you've got lock profile and your uh, analog stick there which is again very nice and then you've got all your buttons around here so you've got one to eight around there okay and now we'll take a look here at all the different components as you can see guys so these are all interchangeable take a look at these these are our buttons okay so on a nice little sheet there so before you press them out it'll be hard to lose but once you do that you might want to keep them in a uh, some little seal bag or something like that um, so you got all your uh, standard playstation controller buttons there okay on that section We have a larger joystick, so interchangeable there. We have another smaller one there. And then we have the large tiles, tactiles. So they're all pretty similar. We have a couple of large flippers. So you've got four of them. Two of them, four of the other ones, and one of the uh, larger round ones as well. And we've also got our connecting cable, so USB-C to C, so for charging and uh, possibly connecting it to the uh, actual system as well. Just see if there's anything behind the uh, actual tray that it's, everything's housed in. There isn't. Okay, so that's everything included in the uh, today's unboxing, guys. Like I said earlier, though, do let us know in the comments what you think, and if you haven't already do subscribe to the channel, but for now, we're gonna conclude this part of the video.
Welcome back guys, so we'll just run through um, a couple of basics um, just um, so you can um, familiarize yourself, um, make it a bit easier. So basically to swap out the, uh, the joysticks, just pop it off. So lifting up guys, okay, and then you can put your uh, desired um, analog stick in. And then with these ones guys, they've got like a little lip on the front. So what you need to do is just push that in and up and it'll unclip. Okay, they do have a magnet, so that's pretty cool. And then you can interchange them with uh, whichever piece you want. Just make sure they're facing the right way. And again, you can't just pick them up and lift them off. You've got to push that tab in and lift them up. Okay, guys, I'm not going to uh, demonstrate the small little um, round ones, but um, there you are, guys. You've got your sort of your uh, PlayStation menu one there. You've got your um, your O and your X there. That's a, uh, a main button there. And then we'll just um, interchange a couple more here. So you can take a look what they're going to look like. So you've got definitely a lot higher raised one there. And then you've got a, uh, a little bit longer here as well, so you, um, you stay away from your uh, your uh, main X button there in the center. And then if you pull two off, guys, then you can stick this one on. He just sort of magnetizes the uh, the large one. I guess he's got more surface area because you can. Uh, I guess you can tap him uh, as uh, as one sort of. Uh, button for that particular one there okay guys so guys uh, if you did enjoy this video don't forget to subscribe to the channel before you leave hit the like button if you didn't hit the dislike once we get to the next milestone we win this giveaway so do subscribe training for that and we'll catch you next time